What a peeps. Got a little DVD toy update. First thing I got here is wasn't for me. I have all the Return of Living Dead in a multi set. Got this for my brother in law. Thought I was going to trade it to him for something I need, which would be Phantasm 3. He only has 1 and 3. I have 1, 2, and 4, and I thought we would trade because he needs this and he's always talking about how hard it is to find. But then I called him up and he didn't seem to be too into the trade and said he'd think about it, which is Return of the Living Dead 3. But if he thinks too hard and doesn't want to trade, it doesn't matter to me because on the multi set there's no special features and this one has a trailer and commentary so if you don't want it I don't mind keeping it got this blu-ray for a dollar not one of my most favorite movies but it's a blu-ray and it was a dollar all card Dewey Cox store it came in one of them blu-ray Best Buy DVD cases and I had this extra blu-ray case kinda Blu-ray case is, it says Blu-ray. It's a PlayStation 3 thing, but it works right. Then I got this because it's got Michael Dudikoff in it, who plays American Ninja, and I like him. So Crash Dive. This one we can't talk about that. You don't talk about Fight Club. Fight Club, except Idiot put their initials on it, like four different times. GM, CJ, CL, something there I can't read. If I wanted, I could just do away with the slipcase logos. No, they tagged this one too, CL. People are idiots. Idiots! Yeah, I looked when I was at the pawn shop. There's like an insert, comes out like this, and there's no scratches on the discs. I checked, so whatever, fuck them and their initials. Watched this the other day, I streamed it and I liked it. I'm surprised to find it at the pawn shop because it's an old movie. Kevin Bacon and Quicksilver. He's a bike messenger. It's like a, you know, like Premium Rush, but I haven't seen Premium Rush, but I assume Premium Rush is like this, but on speed. This was a good movie. Then I found three wrestling. Brand new expensive set for a dollar. Batista, I walk alone. Not a big Batista fan, but like I said, Brand new WWE release for a dollar. They had The Rock, The Epic Journey of Dwayne The Rock Johnson, three disc set. Bray Hart. Bray Hart. Great to hit man Hart. Whatever. We just clutch it. This was my favorite wrestler back in the day. First way back in the day was Jake Roberts. And then Bray Hart. And then an HBK Shawn Michaels. Three disc set. Yeah. Look at these, just don't seem to want to shut. Ha ha! Alrighty. Some of you may remember, probably about three videos back, I found this dude. I know Jeff remembers. 
He's mainly why I'm doing this, showing these. Well, I wouldn't show them anyway, but I know he wants to see them. I found Kevin Nash about three videos ago. Oh. Well, today I picked up DDP. Stinger. These things are crazy. They're super intelligent for an old toy. They have these sensors in their chest and they interact and talk to each other. And they, they take really strong batteries so it's hard to keep them running. But I had them running long enough to have them talk to each other. And I know Jeff really wanted to see that so I recorded a little bit and I'm going to cut the clips of that now. <laughs> 